Excellency asante sana tunaomba usichoke kuja Nairobi kututembelea. Yo Excellency tulikuona Kisumu. Ulikuwa na viongozi wote. Walikuja pamoja. Hata Urengo walikuwa hapo. Hata Gladys Wanga. Hata watu wa Tibim wote walikuwa. Sisi Nairobi siasa tumeachana nayo. Kubali nilete hao MCs wote wa Nairobi, wabunge wote wa Nairobi, wa UDA, wa ODM, wa Wiper Senator wetu, women rep, we come and just talk development. Because the people they represent are the people you're leading. Nairobi hakuna njaa ya mlu ya tafauti na ya mjaluo. Hakuna. Hakuna njaa ya mkamba tafauti na ya mkikuyu. Our problems are the same. What we want is to unite all of us behind you. Na tukifanya hivyo, ata wale wanataka mandamano watakosa watu wakufanya mandamano. Kwa sababu watu watakuwa busy watakuwa busy wakifanya kazi ya excellency ama ni aje watu wangu wa Nairobi si ni hivyo si ni kazi tunataka si ni mboka tunataka ukiona mkutano inaitwa tuesday a tuesday afternoon mkutano ya siasa inaitwa na inaja ni shida na ninja hawa vijana wako nayo tunaomba utuleta tu sote pamoja ya excellency nitamalizia hapo wacha nimkaribisha sasa waziri wetu Zak ili aje atuambie mipango ya serikali kuu. Karibu sana waziri. Um, Your Excellency, the President of the Republic of Kenya, Dr. William Samoy Ruto, Your Excellency, the Deputy President, Rigadi Gashagwa, Excellency Governor wa Nairobi County, Deputy Governor, viongozi wote ambao mko hapa, mabibi na mabwana hamjambo. Your Excellency mwanzo ni kushukuru sana kwa kupata muda huu ili kuweza kuja kuzindua mradi ambao ni wa maana sana katika sehemu hii ya, ya Nairobi. Nakumbuka uh, ni wiki moja iliyopita uh, Your Excellency tulienda kule Ruiru na pia tukazindua uh, muradi mwingine kama huu na hiyo ni dalili tosha kwamba your excellency unajali maswali maswala ya watu kuishi katika uh, sehemu ambazo zina heshima sehemu ambazo ni za kukubalika your excellency kama wizara tumeshikana kabisa na the county government I want to report to you that the beginning of this week tulipatana na committee ya lands housing and urban development ya council of governors na tukaketi chini na tukaweza kukua na mpangilio ambao utaweza kusaidia uh, mradi huu wa affordable housing uweze kuendelea bila tatizo lolote katika sehemu zote za nchi hii yetu Mwanzo kabisa tuliona jambo ambalo ni la muhimu ni kuwa na haki miliki ya mahali kote ambapo tunaanza miradi hii. Kwa hivyo kabla tuje mahali popote kuzindua mradi we, we make sure your excellency that the, the, the land has a title and I want to confirm that already we have a title deed for this land kwa hivyo hapata kuwa na jambo lolote ambalo litaweza kututatiza tusiweze kuendelea. Your Excellency, we've been going around the country as a ministry and miradi kama hii inaendelea katika sehemu nyingi hapa nchini and I want to report that we are still rolling more uh, projects of a similar nature because we want to make sure that the affordable housing agenda is realized not only in Nairobi and other major towns but everywhere mahala kote ambapo wananchi wa nchi hii wanaishi so your excellency we want to thank you we want to thank in particular his excellency the governor uh, of Nakuru, uh, Nairobi county ameweza kuwa na sisi katika mambo yote mipangilio yote ambayo tunafanya and after this week's meeting with the council of governors uh, committee on lands and uh, housing and urban development
development. We are going to see a lot of changes. We are going to be given land by the county government so that sote kama wananchi tuweze kuishi uh, katika nyumba ambazo zinaheshima. So, so Kiambiu will be our next phase. And I want proper planning the same way we are doing in Kibra. We want to do it in Kiambiu so that we can salvage the millions of people. I'm told 30,000 people live in Kiambiu where there is no proper planning, there is no road, there is no uh, hospital, there is no school. Haiwezekani katikati ya mji wa Nairobi eti kuna mahali hakuna shule. Ati hakuna uh, hospitali. Hiyo ni makosa makubwa sana. And we are going to rectify it because we want to do the right thing for the people of the city of Nairobi. Mimi bile bile nataka niwaambie hapa kwa sababu hapa hawa watu wangu wa wizara walikuwa wamepe, wamepanga tujenge nyumba gorofa 16. Lakini nimewaambia hapa Nairobi ardhi ni kidogo sana na haipatikani kwa uraisi. So tumekubaliana manyumba hapa sio gorofa 16 ni gorofa 25. Nataka tuelewane na huyu contractor si umesikia wewe bwana contractor 25 stories. Tumekubaliana? Na wewe inga enda tubadilisha sasa mchoro ikae sawa sawa huyu governor wetu sakaja ataweka tick wananchi wa Nairobi waendelee kujengewa <coughs> tunaelewana jambo la pili mimi nataka nyumba 50% nataka munisikize vizuri 50% ya nyumba hapa ambazo zitajengwa iwe chini ya shilingi Elfu saba mutu analipa na nyumba ikuwe yake baada ya miaka kumi ama miaka kumi.